A report from the El Paso County coroner shows more babies in southern Colorado died in 2018 compared with 2017. Colette Bordelon, the newest member of the News 5 team in studio tonight to explain the uptick here in SIDS. Colette. Well, coroner Dr. Leon Kelly reports that eight babies died last year. That's two more than in 2017 after performing autopsies from 20 counties, including our own. He says these deaths could have been prevented and safety tips about putting your baby to sleep can save those lives. Here you go, bud. Here you go. Laura Serbanescu is always looking out for her son, even when he's sleeping. I would always put him in a footy pajama. Um, I always eliminated any blankets, sheets. She knows babies are at risk when sleeping in spaces not safe for them. I actually had a personal friend um, that he had two of his um, boys pass away through this. Um, so I, I think it's probably the worst thing that could happen to a parent. The El Paso County coroner is concerned about a recent increase in infant deaths while sleeping. Every one of those kids' deaths was preventable with proper education and information and, and action by parents. Dr. Leon Kelly says babies need to be placed on their backs on a hard surface like a crib, and they need their own space. The most common unsafe sleep environments that we see are bed sharing with adults. Baby nurse is Amy. Amy Borchart is a postpartum nurse who says it's not only where babies are sleeping, because they can overheat easily. So most parents want to over bundle them. But they could stop breathing when bundled or when other objects are near. No crib toys or any kind of thing, any kind of objects in the crib. All to make sure sleeping is the least stressful part of having a newborn. Coroner Kelly also says you should never let your baby sleep on chairs, couches, or anything without protective barriers. Always watching out for you, Colorado Springs, Colette Bordelon, News 5.